Multidimensional poverty is uh, very important for us in, in, the, in the Arab region. Um, mainly because, as you know, and uh, many people know, the Arab region is, uh, uh, contains a variety of, of countries. There are very rich countries like the Saudi Arabia and Qatar, and also very poor countries like Somalia, Mauritania, Sudan, Yemen. And unfortunately, a lot of the countries uh, are, uh, in many middle-income countries, are now going in a state of conflict. So you have two uh, groups of countries. You have middle-income countries like Libya, uh, like Syria, like Iraq, uh, that even though they're from a money uh, metric poverty point of view, uh, they used to not have a lot of poverty, but now, uh, unfortunately, after the conflict, you're going to see a rise in multidimensional and money metric poverty. And you also have the LDCs, where you had a, a very high rates of both money metric and multidimensional. Multidimensional poverty is more uh, important for us because it really allows you to capture um, real deprivations. You know? and, and the deprivations of people that go beyond the uh, money metric poverty. Uh, but both of them are important, of course. But, but in, 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 in the UNESCO, we're uh, much more interested in uh, capturing multidimensional poverty because it allows you also a basis so you can compare equally amongst uh, countries.